since I'm pretty sure by my, my the law states that I have a right to confront my witnesses who accuse me of doing wrong. So I felt like I wanted to say it in front of her since she was the one up here slandering okay. me. And that's all I got now, to say. You sure you don't want to talk about the sentencing and all of that? That was the only thing you wanted to tell the court? I mean, that's I haven't heard anything about a sentence. I was just well, commenting on that. I understand the charges. that. And I just wanted to know if you had anything you wanted to say to the court. I mean, I got a lot to say. I got, I, I got a lot to say, but I'm not going to be able to say half of it. I don't know because I don't know what you're going to say. I'm innocent. I didn't do it. Okay. I've, I've maintained that the whole time. I feel like there was things that were allowed to be said that should have never been allowed to be said and didn't have no, nothing whatsoever to do with the case and what was being said. Just because somebody has domestic abuse issues with their spouse doesn't mean that they would put their hands on their kids, which has also been pretty much proved that I've never touched my kids in any harmful manner whatsoever. I've never harmed my kids. I didn't even hear anything that said that I had done anything to her in front of the kids. So that doesn't make sense either. And, you know, just let the record show that I, I, I don't think I ever, ever put my hands on her in front of those kids. And I just don't, I just don't feel like just because somebody has domestic issues with the female in their life that they love that they were just able to just say oh he don't love you and all that stuff just in front of everybody or whatever which doesn't matter but I just don't understand how you find somebody guilty of doing something to a 15 day old baby because there was no evidence whatsoever that proved anything about me putting my hands on my kids I've never done it I never would I don't believe in it I was beat as a child and I don't agree with it at all and I would never do it I would never do this. That's all I got to say. I would never do it. I'm innocent. Well, I can make a lot of comments on what you said. I can make a lot of comments on the trial, but I know that was just be arguing with you or talking with you. I'll ask you one simple question. You claim you're innocent, so you tell me what sentence the man or woman that you claim did this should receive. If you ever find out who did them, they deserve to be under the jail. Okay. So they ought to get the maximum sentence. Most definitely. Okay. On the crime of malice murder, I sent you to life in confinement without parole. On considering the death of another, I sent you to 10 years in confinement consecutive or after. Count one. Do you understand each of your sentences? Yes, sir. I want to advise you that you have 30 days after today to file a notice of appeal. It'll be filed. On this case. I'm going to instruct Mr. Carter on behalf of you to file a motion for a new trial to make sure your rights are protected. If you wish to allege that Mr. Carter did not do an effective job, then we'll bring in another attorney to handle the appeal uh, so that issue can be raised, and that's fine with Mr. Carter. He takes no offense. I think he that. did an incredible job. Well, that's fine. I'm just indicating to you that in order to uh, claim your attorney at trial was ineffective or did not do a good job, you have to raise it at the earliest moment, which would be here. I won't be filing anything against my, my attorney. That's fine. Uh, I also want to inform you that if the case is appealed, if the Supreme Court of Georgia affirms your case, uh, you have four years from that date that the affirmation is made in the, what they call a remediator, the case is sent back down here, to file what is known as a writ of habeas corpus, claiming that your body is still being held illegally and unconstitutional. It has to be done within four years of that date. Four years in one day, they would not listen to it. So do you understand?